You got a boyfriend? Oh, girl. Hell yeah. I ain't eating that I know y'all eat all that curry and shit. I might get smart if I eat that Farquhar or whatever. <laughs> you got a girlfriend? Where's she at? Oh, come here. Let me see how you look. Oh, yeah. Hell yeah. Yeah, yeah. Oh. How long y'all been together? Why y'all ain't married? I know a white guy that date white girls when I see him. <laughs> you date white girls? For real? You got a black girl? Oh, Hispanic. Okay, wh where's she from? Oh, Colombia and Cuba. Where's she at? Where's she? Let me see her. Come here, baby. Let me see you. Oh, damn. God damn. Fuck. You must got a good job, nigga, to pull. God damn. You, you, you sick of his shit? Uh, well, when you sick of his shit, let me know. I get you a way better ring, baby. I ain't gonna fuck you. Nah, but that's, that's cluster diamonds. I get you a solitary stone. Let me know. <laughs> shit. How long y'all been together? That shit new as hell. The way y'all hugging each other, that's new. About a year? Yeah, I can tell us, but yeah, no, no. Look at him. Don't you like to see couples with hope in their eyes? <laughs> Them niggas still believe in love, bitch. You know me. Where'd y'all meet at? A bar. A bar. That's what you do for work? You a cop? Hell yeah, you look like you'll throw a nigga on the pavement. <laughs> what would you have done in the George Floyd situation? You gotta answer that. <laughs> what would you have done? Okay, you're a police officer. Give us your professional opinion as a police officer as what you would have done. <laughs> she out of here. She like, what is that? <laughs> she like, I got a job. <laughs> this nigga drove from West Virginia to be here tonight. What's up, nigga? You must fuck black bitches with them beads on. Nigga. This nigga out here think he pan-African, nigga. Fuck it. Yeah, I believe in Juneteenth, the day the slaves got free. Nigga. This nigga got the, nigga got the fucking Kunta Kente breed. What you do for a living, big dog? I'm a superintendent here in the, right here in the city. What that mean? Right here, I'm a superintendent. Of what, nigga? Like, what the fuck? Of a school? Uh, apartments. Superintendent of apartments. I, I, I've lived in many apartments and I ain't never had a superintendent. Yeah. I've had a landlord. I've had a leasing agent. What does that mean? That's called a handyman, nigga. <laughs> this nigga said I'm a superintendent. This nigga out here, hey, I heard your toilet is clogged up. Let me do my superintendent do this. <laughs> How long you been a superintendent? What'd you do before that? I was a maintenance guy. <laughs> <laughs> this nigga is dead. A luxury okay, I live in a luxury building. We still ain't got no superintendent. Nigga. <laughs> I have a concierge and valet, nigga. We don't have no superintendent. Who you call in the middle of the night? Nobody, bitch. It's just... If my toilet fucked up in the middle of the night, I'm peeing in the sink, nigga. It's, it's that easy. <laughs> what do you mean? You got a girlfriend? Yeah, I got a wife. 
Oh, uh, nigga, I know you can eat any kind of pussy. <laughs> you got a wife? How y'all been married ten years? Yeah. Is she here tonight? She right there. Come here, wifey. <laughs> I don't know, man. Uh, she shook my head, nigga. I beat your ass. Come on, man. Can I grab her booty? Don't lose your girl tonight, nigga. <laughs> All right, boo. Yeah, she got that little thing back down. Look at her. You got wrinkle clothes, nigga. I'll pay for y'all tab and take your bitch. Yeah, hit me with a roast. Uh, David Lucas is really good at titty fucking. Every guy always finishes on his chin. <laughs> See how bad that is? <laughs> you out here with that long ass neck, nigga. You can hold your breath for two hours. <laughs> yeah, go ahead, give me another one, what you got? David Lucas is getting really rich. He's buying a lot of cars. What's really interesting, every car he has, coincidentally, is a low rider. Damn. Give me another one, I, I got faith in you. Give me another one. You have no testosterone, bitch. <laughs> this nigga out here looking like a science project. Get your ass. All right, go ahead, hit me with another one. Look like you get full on bird seeds. <laughs> you look like you had to put air in your shirt before you got here. <laughs> Don't this nigga look like he walk around with fake muscles or some shit? He look like when SpongeBob got biceps, nigga. <laughs> what the fuck wrong with this nigga, boy? Your ass. You, what are you? Oh, Italian, nigga, why your pants crooked? What's wrong with this nigga? <laughs> you look like you just got tossed out by security, nigga, they came back. <laughs> Get the fuck out of here! <laughs> and they came back in the club, nigga, like. What's up, girl? Right. Are you Indian? If I have sex with you, I will have fulfilled all the Infinity Stones. <laughs> You got a boyfriend? Oh shit, girl. Hell yeah. I ain't eating that pussy. I know y'all eat all that curry and shit. I might get smarter. I might get smarter if I eat that pussy? Yeah. Calm down. Calm down. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What made you come here tonight? Where's she at? Oh, hell yeah, that haircut called the police on three niggas. I know that dick small. It's been a long time since I had a drumstick on stage. 